Hello and welcome back to my YouTube channel. It's Dawn here. So today I'm with you. I thought we could make a really simple, quick, easy card using this die here, this flower one. And it's from Fanciful Fronts um, from our lovely Julia. And I've cut it out in um, gold glitter um, in this like um, mottled sort of textured um, pink cardstock. And then in this pink um matte mirror cardstock um i just thought the three went lovely together and this is literally all we're doing um so die cut your pieces that you want to do and um, we're going to keep this very very simple so i want to bring in um a really nice color um what color shall we bring in um, I want to do something really funky so let's bring in Kitsch Flamingo and all I'm going to do is I'm just going to swipe it across like that um, and then swipe it across like that. That's it. That's all I'm going to do. I'm then going to grab my water spritzer and we're going to spray some water on it like that. And then I'm going to grab my rag and we're just going to dry that up. Um, and that's just going to give us um, a little bit of texture on our piece. So there you have it. I mean, oh, sorry. come on. Come on. There we go. So there you have it. That's the texture that we've got. Now, I want some splatters on there. I've got a thing for splatters at the minute. So I don't know if you've noticed, but I am adding splatters everywhere. Um, so let me grab um, some watercolour. Actually, no, let's grab the Victorian velvet. That might be a nice um, splatter. So, and then I'm just going to grab a paintbrush with a bit of water on okay there we are and then we're just going to add some splashes I think I want some green as well right there we go oh that is a lovely color okay now that is that bit um let me just like i said this is a really quick easy card today um i just want let's have a look twisted citron so a nice bright vibrant color um well, i'm hoping it is so i'm just putting some of that on and again coming in with some water um and we're just going to mix that up like so and oh nice and we're just going to bring that in as well so really quick and easy guys this card um not much are going to it so no blending or anything i am useless with my blending um so yeah just wanted to keep it really simple the last card that we made was super super busy so this one is super super not busy <laughs> so let's give this a quick blast like so now it is walking my card but there's a few ways that we can tackle that we can put it under some heavy objects um like books so that it um goes flat once it has finished drying you can iron it <laughs> i'm not going to do that or you can um put this up and put it onto a new card base it is entirely up to you um i will probably just put this underneath some books um yeah and that should straighten it out a little bit there it's just been very stubborn so that is our piece oh that is gorgeous i love that i mean how gorgeous does that look so yeah that is totally crooked um 
but I mean actually do you know what should we just make another card base and stick it on um because I mean I make my own card bases anyway so I think so right I've made this one I think a little bit larger I have excellent so that can be our panel yeah it's just for quickness and ease right now only because um yeah it will be straight with it like as soon as it's put on now i'm gonna grab some um cardboard because i would like this to be um what's the word um on some dimension oh just hitting everything so i'm just gonna trim this down so it's going to be trimmed down so and then i just want to take a little bit off the ends and a little bit off that end as well so it measures seven and three quarters all right okay so that is that done and then we've made our new card base so what i want to do I want to cut a piece of this that is this cardboard that is the same just about the same width and stuff as this okay and that is perfect i'm just going to grab my glue so i am using um my art glitter glue today okay so we're going to stick that down now before i pop um, this down onto the card base i'm going to grab my pieces because they're going to be coming off there um, and i'll need to be able to cut that down so all i want to do is i just want to position these and we're just going to pop some glue down um, I'm going to try and get a bit of glue on those as well and then get the first one down in the center and then we'll stick these ones down okay and again trying to get those a bit of glue on those flourishes so that they right making sure they are the same I mean how gorgeous is this looking very quick very simple and easy background today um yeah and keeping the card very simple as well so it's literally just taken three die cuts oh, up a little there we go right so loving that and then what I'm going to do is just trim off the stalks like that so that is our card front and then we're going to just take our card base and i'm just going to pop some glue down okay and we're going to stick this on the front like that so there's an even border all the way around i'm just going to hold it for a few seconds okay and then i just want a simple um a sentiment so i'm gonna have this one which is let your dreams blossom so that's what we're going to use like so um and then just gonna try and straighten that up a little okay and i'm just gonna have that there um like so but before i do before we do anything with it i'm just bringing in my pink um brush i'm not going to put any um what you call it on any ink on because there's probably enough within the brush itself so i do believe the last ink that i used on this was spun sugar um yeah that just helps it just a little bit right i'm gonna grab some dimension okay and this needs to be a bit there we go and i'm gonna stick that on like so 
and then we're going to go in with this and we're just going to pop it I'm just going to pop it there like that and then to finish off completely I'm going to bring in some gems so I have a huge tub of gems uh where's my gemmy tool there we are I knew you were somewhere I do have a little tool with some gems uh, and then I'm just going to pop these on um got some really small ones which are really pretty oh here yeah so just the three um I think okay so just pop in just a little bit of um glue down oh, oh no don't do it <laughs> I hate it when that happens right okay so there we have it guys that is our quick simple card today using the die set i mean how pretty has that turned out isn't it just gorgeous so i'm gonna leave it there thank you everybody so much for watching please do subscribe if you're not already a subscriber and um, also give me a thumbs up and yeah that would be really cool um thank you so much for watching and until next time happy crafting bye